All right, guys, so in this video, I want to talk about the upcoming update that is going to be taking place with the Disney collaboration and really kind of diving into what the real intention is for this type of collaboration that we are having. So unlike the collaboration we have with Sonic, we are actually getting a more of a decoration uh, themed collaboration where we're having a lot of the cookies uh, that are going to be guests, right? And are going to be used for decoration purpose. And on top of that, we are getting a lot of different uh, decors that are going to be themed for Disney, as well as we are getting a new castle design on top of that. So without a doubt, this collaboration, as well as the event that Dev Sisters are going to be doing from today, all the way uh, to September is really going to be allowing the players to decorate and uh, have this joy of being able to uh, customize uh, their kingdom. And of course, that is not just going to be something that they're adding, uh, but I believe that they're going to be expanding further because if you guys remember from the Dev Now Behind uh, presentation that they gave us uh, regarding all of the updates as well as uh, what they have planned so far, then you guys know that they are not just trying to have players, you know, just decorate and things like that, but they are going to be expanding the decorating system where uh, instead of just having the sort of island, they're going to have another island where you can just decorate on your own as well as going to be having this kind of system where they're going to be able to recommend as well as go through other design without having to f add them as a friend or you know search them up individually right uh, they're gonna have like this community uh, kind of post or uh, community page where you're gonna be able to access uh, different kingdom designs within the game and I believe that they did uh, mention something like uh, you know trying to award players uh, for having uh, and taking the time uh, decorating the kingdom so i believe that that is the theme that they're going with so if you guys clearly see right here on the on the neighbor website not only are they really emphasizing that decorating uh, theme but they are also uh, trying to have uh, players really uh, dive deeper into it and allowing us to have an easier time doing so by adding something like the undo redo uh, being able to switch out of the decorations quickly by overlapping them and uh, you know swapping it you're able to buy multiple decors at once so honestly speaking although this is a Disney collaboration this update specifically is made for those players who are really uh, emphasizing their gameplay on the kingdom design aspect of things. Uh, so, of course, you know, we definitely need to take into consideration of what we want to do with our kingdom now, uh, you know, taking advantage of the space and all that we have, and also the decoration that we are going to be getting. And of course, I believe that this event is definitely going to be a very, very, very free to play friendly event because within the Japanese live stream uh, that they have for Cooker and Kingdom and the upcoming collaboration, they actually showed that they are using a different currency in order to pull for these Disney characters. All right, so they're gonna have like this Mickey Mouse currency where you're gonna be able to use that on that Disney gotcha uh, so definitely it's going to be something you're not necessarily spending the crystals but of course if you are meaning to um, you know try to collect all of the 20 uh, different cookies that are being added then of course some of you guys are going to have to spend that money because you know it is a gotcha game right although this event is going to be for a month and a half uh, there still is that chance of you not being able to collect everything if you guys are free to play however all of the rewards that they're giving out all the crystals as well as all the uh, daily gifts and also from uh, the events that they're going to be doing I'm pretty sure that we are gonna be able to get plenty of crystals plenty of rewards and plenty of uh, resources that Dev Sisters have planned for this particular event and now talking about the uh, cookie side of things or the new cookie that is going to be added you know that cream unicorn cookie is going to be our next epic cookie so uh, you know it's been more than a year honestly speaking that a new healer cookie came out after pure vanilla uh, so pure vanilla was the latest one that we had and to be honest I am expecting a lot and I'm sure a lot of people are expecting uh, cream unicorn to be at least a very good healer that can replace herb or uh, even uh, pure vanilla in cer certain cases because you know like I said it has been more than a year since we got a healer cookie. Definitely, I don't recommend right away for you guys to pull for Cream Unicorn. Of course, if you guys are starting a new account or you guys don't have a healer at hand, then Cream Unicorn is going to be someone you want to pull. Uh, but I will have to say, rather than quickly going into the gacha and uh, spending all the crystals in order to obtain the latest cookie, I will have to say, 
try to wait for some of the reviews that are going to be taking place with all of the different uh you know youtube channels out there including myself i would definitely recommend you guys uh look at and exactly see the reviews of cream unicorn uh give it a day or two and then decide to use your crystals, especially if you guys are free to play. And of course, right now, we do have the daily bounty uh, that is going to be the healer uh, skill powder. So if you guys are lacking in that, which you guys shouldn't be because, you know, uh, to be honest, like I said, there hasn't really been any new uh, healer that has come out. Of course, you don't want to be doing it right away, but wait until the refresh, uh, especially if you guys don't, uh, you know, use your crystals to refresh because you never know if there's going to be quests that is going to be uh, related to the bounty. So they did not specifically say that the bounties as well as, uh, you know, some of the other things that we da do daily are going to be reset. They only said that the uh, metal shop as well as the rainbow shell gallery and things like that are going to be the uh, one that are refreshed. So I uh, definitely would recommend you guys save up on the today's bounty guild boss battle uh especially if you guys are planning to stay up for the update but anyways guys that's just the quick uh information that i want to share with you guys especially regarding uh the new collaboration that we are having as well as the new cream unicorn cookie that is going to be coming out of course just like normal i will be uh pulling for cream unicorn cookie right away and doing the review during the live stream and i'll actually be going live very soon in order to uh stay up with you guys and trying to just uh interact with you guys while the game is going under maintenance anyways guys i hope you guys enjoyed the content i hope you guys are excited for the new disney collaboration that is going to be happening very soon and of course if you guys don't want to miss out on the live stream make sure to hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell and also hit that like button if you guys enjoyed the content anyways guys thanks for watching once again and i'll see you guys all very soon